stop, drop, roll. We all know that that's pretty much what you do when there's a fire. Yeah, we all grew up doing it, but emergency management officials say all South Carolinians also need to know what to do in an earthquake. That's drop, cover and hold on. State House reporter Mary Green has more on a worldwide drill that took place today to highlight the importance of this knowledge. More than 320,000 people across South Carolina registered to take part in the annual Great Shakeout Earthquake Drill on Thursday, including some here at the state's Emergency Management Division in Lexington County. The epicenter of the largest earthquake ever recorded along the eastern United States was outside of Charleston on 31st of August, uh, 1886, and the 7.3 magnitude earthquake devastated the region and was felt from Chicago to Cuba. Studies indicate an earthquake of similar magnitude today uh, would be catastrophic. Scientists say they can't predict when an earthquake will hit in South Carolina, a state they say is vulnerable to earthquake activity from the upstate down to the low country. So emergency management officials say it's crucial for South Carolinians to prepare for one now. They should do that by securing furniture and loose belongings, knowing what's in their insurance policy and prepping disaster supply kits that can get them through at least three days. This is an earthquake drill right now. Drop, cover and hold on. As they did during Thursday's drill, they also encouraged South Carolinians to practice what to do in an earthquake. Drop, cover and hold on. Drop where you are onto your hands and knees. Cover your head and neck with one arm and hand as you crawl for shelter under a nearby table or desk and hold on to your shelter with one hand while, until the shaking stops. Thursday's drill also coincides with earthquake preparedness week here in South Carolina. Reporting Lexington County, I'm Mary Green. 14 low magnitude earthquakes have been recorded in South Carolina since January. On average, the state experiences between 10 to 20 earthquakes a year.